Hey guys, this is Grenade Launcher 101 here. I'm um, here to do a bit of a, like a retry for Mission 4 on PS2 Chaos Theory. So, here we go. <clears throat> now, with this part right here, seems a bit tricky, but I promise you it is not. So, you get all the way here to this plant. Where he can't hear you. Wait for that camera to point in the direction, like pointing towards that wall, so you can stick to this wall. So that when the camera comes, you can unstick yourself to the wall, just to stick yourself to this part of the wall right here. And then when he turns around, OCP that light, and then tap the second camera right there. Gotta keep my eyes wide open. Then once you're done with that, get back on the wall. Wait for that guy again. <clears throat> and once he turns around, you're in the clear to go through this door right here. Now, this next part I know for a fact that I have messed up on in my ghost most run for this mission on the PS2 so I'm going to reach for that now mm. probably wasn't the best time to do so whoa okay that was very close but uh here Once you get up to this point, save. This may take you multiple tries, but I promise you, this is the way to do it right here. Who's that? I thought I saw something. Good work, Fisher. That's four of six cameras tapped. Keep an eye out for the other two. Bam. <clears throat> That's how you do that part. Sorry I wasn't able to like do that at the time when I was doing Ghost Run for the PS2 Tetrology series. But I'm hoping that this makes up for it. I truly do. So I better get back to you guys here in a second. All right, guys, I'm back. So this next part right here, we're going to have to distract the guard again. Now, it's worth noting at this point that when you go through that door entering into this room, there is no other way around it. He is going to perceive you no matter what. But as long as you have so but as long as you have that TV or let me rephrase that. As long as you have less illumination around your area, then you should be just fine. 
Now, when you get here, just save because <clears throat> this can go wrong in many ways. Sorry about that. My nose is stuffy. But, um, yeah. You can basically OCP the TV again. Or you can try something different. But either way, you're going to have to use some sort of distraction to be able to get this guy back on his feet. Come on out! You can't hide forever! Nothing here. Never hurts the check. All right. So that's that done. Now, I'm gonna show you guys how to get her on the camera and the two guards up here. The one camera that I was the second one I had to um, tap on the way in here. <clears throat> Now, as I showed you guys before, sticking to the walls is the absolute key here. Now, when you get back through here, it's going to be the same thing as well. And you only have to OCP that light once, and that is when you tap that camera right there on the wall. So, once he turns around, be on this wall right here. Now you want to save in the process just to be sure that this is going to work depending on what you do <clears throat> all right That was scary. Um, what happened? Okay, I guess I'll just load back. Now, when you do this though, look behind you so that you know for sure that the infrared beam is not going to point at you when you go through back through here. So that was that was it guys, um, thank you for watching, I hope that helped you guys out loads more of it and the other video did. Now, as always, this is Grenade Launcher 101 signing off, take care guys.